Hey, welcome back. My name is Sushal Sutish and I am an instructor for this MS700 Teams Administrator Associate Examination course. In this lesson, we are going to evaluate upgrade path with coexistence and upgrade modes. When you are upgrading from Sky for Business to Microsoft Teams, either online or on-premises, there are only two approaches. Direct upgrade journey or gradual upgrade journey. In direct upgrade journey, you first deploy teams alongside Sky for Business in islands mode as part of evaluation. The goal is to quickly retire Sky for Business from environment for all users in the organization. It is the recommended journey for Sky for Business online customers. In direct upgrade journey, teams are deployed to all users in the organization and configured in islands mode. You can see the direct upgrade journey illustrated in this diagram. In case your organization is currently a Sky for Business on-premises deployment only, you need to start planning to implement Sky for Business Hybrid before upgrading your users to Teams only mode. A gradual upgrade journey offers coexistence and individual upgrade modes for different groups of users, also called cohorts. In this path, Teams is deployed for the organization in islands mode for evaluation and then move on to the different coexistence mode for different groups of users. You can see the gradual upgrade journey illustrated in this following diagram. Now that we have learned about the two upgrade journeys, direct and gradual, let's go and learn about how to manage Microsoft meetings migration in the next video. Till then, take care.